What's up guys, once again welcome back to Digital Perspective. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create this aesthetic banner using Invert Effect in Adobe Photoshop. So let's quickly start it. So first of all, open the image in the Photoshop, then go to Layer Panel and press Ctrl G to duplicate it and then go to Adjustment and add black and white effect. And select both the layer and press Ctrl E to merge it. Then again press Ctrl J to duplicate it and hide the last two layers. Now again go to adjustment and add invert effect. Also add levels. Now make sure you have added both the effect and create a clipping marks. Like that. Perfect. Now select levels and adjust the level properly. Here I'm adjusting the levels so it should look like glow effect I think it's perfect yeah now it's perfect then select rectangle tool and create a rectangle on her eye like that yes perfect now take the rectangle below the image layer and create clipping marks perfect now unhide the second layer here I'm rotating the rectangle slightly so should to the slide effect yes perfect now make sure you have selected the rectangle shape here then go to filter stylize and click on wind now convert to smart object now select the wind and from left to right now you have to repeat this process for 8 times. So here I am fast forwarding the video. Once you are done with repeating the effect for 8 times then select the rectangle shape and Ctrl J to duplicate the layer. Now we have to select first wind effect and we have to change the direction from the right from left to from right and click OK. Now we have to do this for all the 8 so I am fast forwarding the video again. So here we are completed with the wind effect on her eye. Now we have to add some elements so first I am going to create a circle over there. Perfect. Now I will go to filter, stylize, wind convert to smart object and wind and now we we'll select from the left I will repeat this process for more two times perfect now we have to add our title and subtitles so first I will write the text Alexa visualizer now I will drag it over here also I will change the font to Bebas new bold and the font size will be 570 both now I will change the line height so line height will be 480 perfect I will align it to the left bottom side. Nice. Now we have to write our subtitle. So here I am selecting text tool and writing the beyond. Uh, first let me change the uh, font. Here I am selecting options. Light and the font size will be 1. No, 82 and the line height would be 120 perfect now i will write scene beyond this screen with alexa's cinematic journey perfect now we are lying it here like that
yes perfect i think it's looking cool now we have to add wind effect to the title also so here i'm selecting the title and go to filter stylize and wind convert to smart object and again select wind and from right I'll explain this process again. Perfect. So hope you have enjoyed and be sure to hit like and subscribe button if you haven't and also hit the bell icon for more such like updates. Meet you all in the next video. Bye.